West Virginia Public Broadcasting, for over 50 years. Quality, award-winning programming and services for and about West Virginia. Hey everyone, it's Education Station, the show where we invite teachers from all across West Virginia to submit videos of themselves teaching their favorite lessons. When we let that ball go and it moves from here, 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 here and up, that's kinetic, 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 because it's moving. A walking camel bed? That is new. I've never seen a walking camel bed. Have you? Hi everyone, space gal Emily Calandrelli here, floating above our home, almost seven, West Virginia. In which county is North Bend State Park located? Richie. That is great. Give them a good round of applause, everybody. We've got a good match going. We've had many emergency situations throughout the Mountain State that have required information to make it to people who geographically can't get that signal right now. The new standard allows for the signals to warp around mountainous regions to be able to make it to the people who need that information. Good evening from Charleston, I'm Suzanne Higgins. What we have to do is build to the areas that we know currently have no service and no funding source. They have to be balanced against other considerations fundamental personal freedom. Embrace our moment here in time. A pandemic. No living West Virginian has ever been through this before. Right now, cases are accelerating faster in West Virginia than in any other state. Us and Them audience is around the world. Most of our downloads are in Texas and in California. We are able to tell West Virginia's story to the world. Nothing easy about that, but uh, you seem to uh, tame that hurdy-gurdy beast over there. So, uh, <laughs> well, sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Your 2021 Arts Alive is a very, very special occasion. This marks the 14th year we've celebrated the arts in West Virginia. With Lee Hammonds was my great-grandfather, and... Uh, I feel like they'd be very proud of me for standing here today. Um, it amazes me how recognized they are today for something they did so long ago. Snowflakes fill the air, carols everywhere. If you're a good role model to your team and staff, that when times get tough, 
they'll look to leadership and say, hey, he's as calm as a rock, he's intense, but he's ready to go and he's got our back. Any piece that you're looking at, you're gonna step into that world, right? So I think he deserves to not have to explain because originally I believe that a lot of his creativity and his need for art came from his experience in Vietnam. Norfolk became the basketball capital of the world, not just the United States in that period of time. It's to Crenshaw, that's it. A national record tying seven championships. West Virginia Public Broadcasting. Everything we do is in service to West Virginia.